He is the clean-shaven counterpart of Mr. Redlegs and was the face of the franchise during the Big Red Machine era. His name is Mr. Red, and this is a Mr. Red bobblehead, a giveaway item from a 2002 credit card promotion. In 2002, Red's fans were cheated to five different bobbleheads given out over the course of the year. During the regular season, the team gave out nighters of Johnny Bench, Chris Sabo, Eric Davis, and Adam Dunn. And right after the season ended, a celebrity softball game was held at Riverfront Stadium right before it was demolished, and an unofficial Cincinnati Reds Pete Rose bobblehead was given out for this event. However, a sixth bobblehead was also given out during the season, and it was a Mr. Red bobblehead. Now you got this bobblehead by signing up for a credit card inside Riverfront Stadium. I'm not too entirely sure of the details of this promotion, but from what I've read, as long as you signed up for the credit card, you got the bobblehead. The Nodder measures around 7.5 inches tall and features Mr. Red in the home Red's uniform that the team wore in the late 90s and early 2000s. The base is a plain green circle that says Red's on the front in white letters. The pose Mr. Red is in is very simple, as he's just standing there while holding a bat against the ground. And even though it was given out as part of a credit card promotion, the bobblehead looks fantastic, as some of the details such as the stitching, the smile, and the Red's logo are spot on and look great on the Nodder. These are some of the rarest Red's bobbleheads in history because there are so few of them out there, and also of how you got them, by signing up for a credit card in Riverfront Stadium in 2002. Occasionally, these will be posted on eBay, but those can be very expensive. They'll usually sell for around 80 to over 100 bucks, and the ones that are posted on eBay usually have the heads crooked. I don't know why, but every time I see these on eBay, the head is either looking to the left or to the right. I was lucky enough to find mine with its head on straight at a thrift store for well below what you find it in eBay. It was a steal, an idea that I could not pass up. If you do find one, however, make sure it's priced decently as you don't want to be ripped off. Also, if you just want a Mr. Red bobblehead for your collection, then chances are you should be able to find one pretty easily, as there are a ton of Mr. Red bobbleheads available. This one, however, is one of the nicer looking Mr. Red bobbleheads, and if you come across one for a decent price, I suggest you pick it up for your collection.